The simple answer is we don't know what causes OCD. What we know is that OCD has been associated with a hyperactive circuit in the brain that includes the orbital frontal cortex involved in planning and decision making, the basal ganglia which is involved in motor acts and motor learning and habits, and the thalamus which filters information coming into our nervous system. And what we know is that that, si that circuit does not seem to be functioning normally in OCD. In addition, there are other parts of the brain that we think also contribute to the symptoms of OCD. Now that's the brain circuits underlying OCD. That's what generates the obsessions and compulsions. But what causes the brain circuit to be abnormal, that's a different question. And that's what I would call etiology of the disorder. And there we have a lot of different clues. There could be a lot of different ways that brain circuit becomes abnormal, including a genetic vulnerability to OCD, infectious causes, environmental causes. And so in the end, we say, well, we think OCD is caused by some combination of genes, the environment, and development.